Um, all right, so the first uh, big news, uh, Pinar Toprak. I hope I pronounced that name correctly. She is a female score composer, and she has been hired by Marvel Studios to write the music score for Captain Marvel movie. This marks uh, Pinar as the first time female composer of an entire score for a major superhero movie project. So this is a big deal, guys. I know a lot, you know, maybe some of you are like, oh, so what? You know, it's just, an, it's just another composer. But no, no, this is this this um this is the first time. This has never happened before. Um, you know, when it comes to Marvel, we expect names like John Debney or um or Alan Silvestri, which is fine. They're they're amazing talents. Uh, but somebody like Pinar Toprak, who's an um, uh, number one South Asian, I think, descent, uh, and then female, uh, to be in charge of something as big as Captain Marvel, you know, as big project like this, that's a big deal. So congratulations to congratulations to Pinar Toprak. I hope I I, I hope I did not butcher that name incorrectly. <laughs> um, and you know, this also goes to show that Marvel Studios continues to be um, in the forefront of championing diversity in this industry. Um, and, and I'm glad they do that. You know, they, if you've heard me before that how much I hated Thor Ragnarok, <laughs> but the fact that Marvel gambled on Taika Waititi and allowed him to Taika Waititi's Thor, basically, you know, uh, making Thor be a Taika's sense of humor kind of movie. Uh, that's something to be respected. You know, I may not disagree with it, but I respect it at least, you know, and, uh, as opposed to WB, who kept hiring Zack Snyder again and again and again. I was like, come on, Zack Snyder's not the only talent in this business. Come on, WB, gamble on other talents as well. So, um, for Marvel to hire to have hired Pinar, it's it's amazing. I can't wait to hear the music. Um, Captain Marvel stars Brie Larson as the title character, uh, and Brie Larson is a very uh, strong public voice of feminism. Uh, so I'm maybe I'm assuming she has some kind of a contribution to uh, Pinar being hired. Who knows? Um, but for a movie that stars a female superhero to have a female composer uh, as part of it, that's 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 just fantastic. Uh, the movie comes out March eighth, two thousand nineteen, and so make sure you mark that on your calendars. 